The CEOs at Aptera have been in some recent interviews. Here are some highlights from those. The original videos are in the description. The Aptera will have six subsystems, battery pack, rear suspension, front suspension, body, interior, and closures. Chris confirmed they're still using vinyl film for the Aptera body. We now have 12,000 investors. Chris mentioned they've raised $50 million with crowdfunding so far, 25 million with private money. 2023 is the goal for IPO or public or going to the stock market. There are 800 Aptera ambassadors worldwide. They have 600,000 people following them on social media. And this wasn't mentioned in the video, but on an earlier call this year, they mentioned that their newsletter has an open rate of like 80%, which is absurdly high. It's really good. Just people are just craving it, that new Aptera information whenever it gets put out. Chris mentioned the changes to Delta are very subtle, like lighting changes, the cut line changes. The Delta design has been worked on for the past six months. The goal is to finish the Delta design by the end of the year. Jason Hill said mid-November as an estimate a couple of weeks ago. The belly pan on Aptera works with the inverters, motors, battery, and AC. The solar in connects on the solar panel was visible on the Gamma build. Chris said on production, you won't see them as much. The steering will be speed sensitive, which is good to hear. He mentioned the trunk space will be lower by 50 millimeters from the Alpha builds. And if you push the seats forward, you have seven feet of sleeping space from the back of the seat to the rear of the trunk. Sandy Monroe's involvement is more clear. They helped how to build the vehicle, how to lay out the factory, how to select for design equipment, the equipment that goes on the robotics, the AGVs or automated guided, guided vehicles. They have gone through the Aptera battery design and provided feedback to make it less expensive, more robust, etc. There is probably not one single element on the vehicle that Sandy's team has not put their input on. They are still designing for the Tesla plug, still in negotiations with Tesla. Aptera is hosting a business mixer with the Swedish American Chamber of Commerce at their factory in San Diego. If you're a non-member, it's $30. If you're a member, it's $20. It's this October 20th at 6 p.m. If you live in the area, it might be worth checking out. The uh, description says they're going to talk about how Aptera applies 3D printing, AI, and composite materials to their design. So, if all else, if you've never seen Gamma in person, this might be a fun opportunity to see it. Most likely, you'll be able to sit in it as well. And possibly some information, so if you go, let us know what you, what you find out. Those are the latest updates. Let me know your thoughts. See ya.